Ok. So here we um we try to finish up to finish up with um the stages of counseling. This is counseling psychology, it's under your psychology. So uh stage one, there's five stages of counseling that um has to take place for to be processed or to be um uh, to be a, a well, well, well completed counseling process. So number one stage is called initial disclosure or being popular known to say building up of the relationship. And that is a phase to stage or that is a phase to what a process of a stage. Building up of a relationship. Number two, there is another one which is called what? In depth exploration or we call it problem assessment. Number three, uh, we call it goal setting or what uh, or commitment uh, to action. Number four, we call it counseling intervention. Number five, we call it evolution, termination, or refrow. Evolution, termination, or refrow. This is uh, a quite, a quite dangerous, quite dangerous, and very much carefree final stage of counseling, really. Yes. So, the first stage. Relationship building. So the first stage relationship building this is just based on when it comes to uh, the issue of um, uh, the first stage where uh, the uh, trained professional is um, keep on knowing, knowing the car, the car, the, the cancery. Keep on knowing the client. And this is very much stage which is very much careful, of which uh, it is a first stage where now the base matters, building up the foundation or the uh, between the client and the counselor. Of which now here the building up of the strong relationship has to be used. The relationship is based on the what uh, on the you know, on the what on the uh, uh, trust. The 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 the, 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 uh, the, the relationship which be based on what um mature respect. The, the relationship which based on what confidentiality. And during the same relationship, this is the time of which now the counselor has his tribal means he or she has tribal means to, to, to give out or to ask some question. Has to be very much pay attention when it comes to the signs and signals, when it comes to, uh, to, um, to, to, this, uh, to the ways of communication, such as verbal communication, non verbal communication. And has to know very, very much um, a client, has to be reflecting, no smiling. Has to be using those uh, co communication skills or counseling skills, co counseling skills, reflecting smiles so that the patient can be well comfortable when it comes to answering some questions. And also, in the other hand, it has to be very much to listen, very much careful, very, very much careful. So, when it comes to trouble means to provide solution indirect on his own perspective, it's very much easy. And also, it has to be very much. Um, Pay attentive attention uh, when it comes to, uh, um, to when when a client is ask is 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 ex explaining and also listen very much careful yeah quite these are some of the uh, uh, skills has to be used in terms of building up a relationship because on this relationship to be based on a trust this relationship be based on what confidentiality this relationship be a relationship be based on what uh, um. Of the charity. So these are some of major, major things when it comes to what relationship. Yeah, I mean relationship building under the process of counseling. So stage number two, this uh, was stage called deep exploration or a problem assessment. So this is a stage of which a counselor uh, to, be, to, be, to, to be very much careful and in depth when it comes to asking, and also this is this, this a stage of which uh, with the table means to build a collaborative beneficial relationship so that even the client is very much what is very much, um, is very much what is very much comfortable when it comes to what to be uh, answering the questions. And also, this is some of the stage of which the some counselor has to be trouble means to re, um. To be drawing out some of the information gotten to the current sort of situation, for instance, life. I mean, a uh, 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 life, work, home, education. They are uh, uh, and and the reason that they have engaged in the counseling. Yeah. Uh, this is this is some of the things of which also the client trouble means to find out ways. What is the reason why you are in this uh, counseling? 
and also try to driving out some of the information regarding to life, work information, or let me say some necessary, uh, uh, irrelevant information, irrelevant information that is not even uh, 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 um, uh, uh, I mean, uh, uh, pertain to the to 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 the to, to the, uh, the, the 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 problem that the counselor is trying to be to solve. So if uh, the counselor is trouble means to regarding, I mean, removing them out, uh, and also withdrawing them out, it will be very much important to remain with what relevant information. And also stage three, which is called commitment uh, to. Or the what of the um. Some of the things that uh, well, what are some of the predisposing factor, the contribution that has to the, to 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 um to the, to, to let me say to uh to 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 result into this problem. And in the same, if if uh, he identify all those kind of mistakes, all kind of strongness, now it is quite interesting and quite good. Or, 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 or it, it is very much important and very much uh, um, very much important. Now the counselor and the counselor they come now in what in progress or they come now in agreement to say, okay, it is good. We can try almost to set up some goals. The goals that will help us to remove the goals that will help us to do what to combat this problem. The goals that will help us to do what to kill this problem. What are some of these goals? And those goals have to be based on the matter or the problem that is on the table. They have to be based, and those goals has to be what has to be agreed upon to each other. Has to be very much simple, so that even if the client is alone, in mind, mind you, the purpose of counseling, you're trying to help the client to develop his conscious mindset of solving his own problem, understanding the situation, the problem, so that he can solve on his own. You are not trying to work, you are, you are not helping, you are not helping the client to understand, you are not helping the client to solve, uh, to, you are not helping the client to solve the problem, but to understand the situation. Those are some of the things the do's and no, uh, the do's and what, uh, 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 the, the don'ts and the do's of the what, of the, um, uh, of the counselor, uh, the counseling. So when it come, when you agree yourself to say, okay, good, these are some of the goals that you have to put in place. Okay, these are some of the goals that are very much simple. You simplify them. You understand them. Because as you are trying to build up some relationship in the first stage, your trouble means to know, to listen very much carefully, understand very much carefully, so that it can be easy for you to understand on your own perspective. It can be easy for you to solve the problem. So after I've done that, one good to go to counseling intervention or inter intervention. So this is a stage which depend on the counselor and theory uh, uh, um, on, the, on the counselor and the theories that they are familiar with as well as the situation the client is faces. You know, this is some of the things of which um, of which are the 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 the, uh, the, uh, the counselor of which the counselor is trouble means to put some of the theories which are regarding to the situation. Some of the theories are studying the theories, but it's, it, it, it is that some of the people client who do not know understand the theories. They do not need of your counselor trouble means to explain the theories. No theory said this and this. It's more like some of the theories they provide the solution. It will be quite interesting if you are relating, connecting to each uh, and name, each, 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 each other and, and, and provide the, word, the concrete indirect solution. For example, um, the behavioral approach may suggest engaging activities designed to help the client order the, their behavior in a comparison. Person uh, centered approach uh, six, uh, six, um, sorry, uh, six to engage the client's self actualization tenders. You know, your, your trouble means the logical approach to counseling those kind of theories, your trouble means to do what to, uh, to involve them. For instance, we talk about a behavioral approach of cancer to about problematic thinking and behavior occur when the environment is supported. What does it say? It said to say there has to be engagement of what enforcement agencies which can to put in place in order to what to combat those problems, those solutions. So your trouble means as a cancer to engage those what those theories and put them together. Yeah, the last one, we've got evolution, termination, or refro. This is you have to make sure that you, you leave 
the client or you trouble me to uh, scrutinize, go through those some of the goals, go through those some of the theories regarding are they trouble me simple to, to the client to solve them or is the client is capable of solving this problem in my absence? Is the client comfortable with this? If the client is not comfortable with those solutions, indirect solution, indirect um, indirect um Solution, which means I have to go back. And not this, I've forgotten one thing in cancer, in the same cancer in that intervention. If the client, this is also the way you have to be very much careful. What are some of the things which are, are how far, what are some of the challenges uh, is the client say uh, facing? Is he understanding some of the goals that you had to set? Okay, good. Now, you go in the same, the, the, the five stage, the five stage now, okay, the client is good, okay, it's understanding, okay, good. What are some of the challenges he's facing? What are some of the things that can we remove? Okay, is he need some of, uh, is, is need of, or uh, is need of some of our simply, is, is, uh, means to provide the explanation? Okay, what are some of those simplified explanations? You, you trouble means to remove them and make things what easy. This is a final stage of which has to be very much dangerous. Yeah. Because the trouble means to do what to conclude. And not that as you do what, it is your duty now to be checking up of the client. Uh, for instance, you conclude, okay, it's capable of solving them. You conclude now. You may find to say, as you provide those solutions in dialect, the client is able to, to identify to say, oh, this is a solution. Okay, this is a problem. Oh, this and this. And know that as you are doing that, you are helping the, the client to, to understand his own situation. Don't make sure, you have to make sure that the client is having a variety of solutions to solve them. Not only one solution. Intellect ones. Oh, okay, I can do this. Okay, I can do this. Good. Okay, then. Good for that. So, those are some of the things that are supposed to be what to put in place. Yeah. And you have to be make sure that you should do to be checking up of the client. Oh, how far, Mr. John? Oh, good. How far that issue? Okay, I'm trying. Okay. But, okay, good. But did you do this? Okay, good. Thank you. You are checking up on him because, you know, that's, that, that's a process. Yes, it has some of the skills. Um, I go back just there to the to the skills. Yeah, there are some of the skills that um has to put in place as we are doing that. I've explained them. I've explained them most of them. Yeah, things such as um uh helping the client. Let me say, listen very much carefully. Pay much attention. Listen, pay much attention to comes to uh, 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 non-verbal and verbal communication. Refresh, smile, using the communication, using the communication. I mean, you're using those kind of skills. And not only that, you have to be very much, uh, you have to be questioning, asking questions in a good way, in a comfortable way. Yeah, and quite a little interesting when it comes to paying much attention, it comes to non-verbal communication and verbal communication, those communication skills, pay much attention to those, yeah, so that you can be changing the tactics of asking questions. Thank you very much. I really appreciate If there's any question, pop up in the comments section so that we know how we help each other when it comes to understanding this health uh, psychology, uh, counseling psychology, Processes. Thank you very much. Take time. Stay blessed.